Hey everyone, Angelo here. Welcome to another design tutorial. Today I'm going to take you through steps on how to design or create your own QR code in Adobe InDesign. This is a feature that not many people know exists. It's a great way of having this barcode set up in, in your print documents um, so people can scan it to take you to a URL hyperlink. Um, it could take you to a set up text message. Um, an email or even you could set it up as plain text um, but for today we're gonna focus our attention on how to link it to a URL as you can see here I've created one in this mock-up and I placed it on this left hand side page this is kind of like a brochure or travel guide for Banff Alberta or Lake Louise okay so um, I'm going to hyperlink that barcode to um, to the website Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so there's my layout here. Just to give you a heads up or a, an idea of the layout that I'm working on, in case you're wondering, I go to File, Document Setup, and I am again working on A5 Landscape. Uh, six pages, you can set that to you want. Make sure that you have facing pages on, hit OK. I've created my guides in my master pages, so it takes effect on all my pages in my document, okay? So the first thing you wanna do when, you want, when you're creating a QR code or quick response code is go up to object and generate QR code. I'm going to click that and let me just cut that for now. When this defaults, it's gonna default as plain text. We're gonna focus our attention on setting up a web hyperlink. So I would select that, and as you saw, I had my, my website already in place there. If I go to my web browser here, this is the site that I want to direct that barcode to. So I would just go up here, Command-C, let's go to, back to InDesign, and Command-V https www.banfflakelouise.com okay a couple things before i hit okay i'm just going to leave this black for now but if you wanted to change the color the specific color to this you can create a swatch and go ahead and change the color of it to that um, specific color okay but again i'm just going to leave mine black for now go back to my content so there it is okay and as you can see there's my QR code in my cursor. It's loaded and ready to go. I'm just gonna click, drag, hold, and make it something like that. Okay, and I'm going to align it so it aligns with my type, my body text here. So again, alignments are up here. I want it to align to the selection, and I'm just gonna make sure that's centered. Um, horizontally there okay so there you go that's how you do it and I'm gonna test it out here I have my I got my cell phone here ready to go grab my QR scanner I'm gonna zoom in here and I'll show you on my phone there it is it's saying open. I'm going to open that website. And there it is, Banff Lake Louise. Okay, so that barcode essentially took me to that hyperlink. It's a great way of taking users to hyperlinks or any other kind of uh, platform like a text message and things like that. This can transfer to print. You can change your workspace to digital publishing if you're going to make this into an ebook or something. You can also transfer it to an interactive PDF. So even if this is a digital layout that is on a digital platform, that's fine too. So there's many ways of transferring this over, okay? So that's, uh, that's it. That's how you add a barcode in a InDesign file. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial and we'll talk to you soon. Take care.